grasp of the Third Reich. A coalition of Allied commandos thrown together and aimed at where our enemy was most vulnerable. This was meant to be our first and only mission. Time, Novak. Hey, stop! Ah. Fuck you, Neil! I'll cover you from this fox car. Remember, I don't want them to see us coming. They can't see anything when they're dead. Shimmy down it and get inside.
Let's not chance it. Take the roof this time. Ah!
properly shot at. Mike, the officer in charge tell us what the hell we're doing here. That submarine base is our final stop. Once we're in, we move to secure the objective. He wants us to secure it, but you won't tell us what it is. Kingsley's been dancing around that since the get-go. This ain't just another Easter egg hunt, is it? Yeah, mate, what's the bloody story? We don't quite know. You mean the SO fucking E doesn't quite know? You know what? I'm gonna go pull the bricks. All we have is a name. Phoenix. <laughs> oh, so we got no idea what we're up against. That's the mission. To find out. SOE says the Krauts are moving something big out of Germany. Could be a document stash. The holiest of holies. We are here to pinch it. If this is so important, why did they not send an army? They did. The six of us. Mate, we're not from the same army. Hell, we're not even from the same continent. Quiet! Get back! Why were we chosen for this fucking suicide mission? Brass handpicked six specialists to hit the crowds fast and get away clean. An army can't do that. Too loud. Too slow. Which is right. They won't see us coming. In and out with those papers before they know it. Do we understand the plan? I shoot Nazis. They die. That's my plan. Just across these tracks. I'll cover you from this box car. Christ! I hate dogs. Let's get it done. Take them out.
He's dead ahead! Almost there! Keep going! Dogs! <laughs> Novak! Take out that sniper! Move it! Everyone inside! Party. Looks like they left in a hurry. Phoenix, we must be close. Not for long. Crowds are moving their stash onto a sub. See that lot lugging that chest? I bet you London to a brick. That is what we're after. So what are we waiting for? Time to bring the heavy stuff. Now we're talking. Wait. We can't go in loud. Arthur? Whatever's in those papers is the best kept secret in the Third Reich. And the crowds kept them here. In the arse end of nowhere. So what? It makes no sense. It's like leaving the crown jewels on the front porch. With hardly anyone watching them. The entire German army should be guarding this place. We're not the only ones who don't know what Phoenix is. You're saying Nazis are keeping secrets from Nazis? I'm saying the ones in charge of the secrets are the most dangerous. Yeah, that's why we brought the guns. To shoot them. Are we done here? Those papers are about to piss off out of Germany. You three? Take the catwalk and make your bloody noise. Buy us time. Webb, no back, you're with me. We'll take the boat. Let's go. We'll cover you from the catwalk. Then look for a way out of this trouble. Don't shoot us, or we'll leave without you!
a minefield this time. We're going aboard. Good luck, kids. I'll find us a way out of here. There's the hatch. This is it, lads. Let's find that crate and get out of here. Richard, watch our backs. No back. You take the lead. Let's stay ahead. Watch for ricochets. Room. Let's get that hatch open. Stay close. Tossing grenade. Safe cracker. Be the honest, will you? Our 
Christopher! The sirens have stopped. That can't be good. We've got to move. Now. Novak, help me. Delightful. You think you're British? A Cambridge man, through and through. So, you know better than to ruin a man's evening. Beethoven's fourth sonata has exquisite. But demanding passengers that deserve my full attention. Unlike you. Does the Negro give orders in English too? And do you follow them? Sie wissen, wie es ist, von einem schwarzen Befehler entgegenzunehmen. Er spricht auch Deutsch! <laughs> Please. Proceed. Your Rhineland accent. You must be from Neustadt. During the occupation, you saw French soldiers who looked like me carry guns in your streets. Marry your women. That's what I hear when you speak German. <laughs> We thrashed you once. Hear those bombs? That's us, thrashing you again. Thrashing. <laughs> thrashing. What an interesting choice of words. I told you already. Get on with it. Yes. That's what you want. To sacrifice yourself. To be a, a leader. <laughs> I am not here to give you what you want. Quite a contrary. Ah! Ah! I am here to give you monsters what you say. Stop! Stop! Dispose of that. Put the rest in the trap. Fucking savage! Get your hands off me, son! Novak. Jesus Christ. People die. People die when command fucks up. How exactly is this Arthur's fault? This is on him. And on Wade. That bastard abandoning his team. Well, you're right about Wade. If he shows his face again, I'll bloody kill him myself. Oh, yes. Let's keep blaming each other instead of the Germans. <laughs> Is that supposed to impress me? Relax. It does not matter. Freisinger is going to kill us all. Freisinger? The Nazi. The one who killed Novak. 
old friend of yours, is he? We have history. Oh yeah, what kind Forget of history? Forget Freisinger. Arthur will get us out of this. What, because he's your mate? He wasn't always. But I've seen him in action. You lose men. That's war. Sometimes the only way to honor a fallen soldier is to finish the mission. But try remembering that while their blood stains your boots. If you're meant to lead, you have to learn what it's like to lose men. To have them die trusting you. And it's only one way to learn that lesson. First time I did was on D-Day. Until dawn to achieve our objective. And it seems like the crowds already know we're coming. Now we've got one chance to demolish the coastal artillery. But if we don't, the invasion tomorrow will fail. Now I trained you all for this. Let's not let the Navy show us up. So take the case, mates. Blast the artillery and fire your flares to let the Navy know the job's done. It. You know the drill. Stand up! Hook in! Stand by! See you on the
granate! Damn you, Kingsley. We picked you as a crowd. Lucky we didn't fill you full of lead. Nice to see you, gents. Where do we stand? The captain didn't make it, so we're on our own now. I say we dig in and wait for the rest of the sick airborne to assemble. Henry said we have till dawn to destroy the artillery. If we don't, the invasion fails. 
So you fancy yourself the captain now? Sunup's an hour away at best. There's no time for a sit-down. Yeah, there's also no muscle or no cavalry coming to save the bloody day. The only thing we can do here is to die or try not hey, to. Hey, you two scrapping nobles got the bigger bollocks ain't gonna solve nothing. Those German casemates aren't that far away. I think we can get to them in time. So I say we take them out. The company's scattered. We're pissing in the wind at this point. You know what's at stake. You all do. This is madness. Hey, we're beyond madness. Look, I'm with Arthur. We finished the mission. All right, Kingsley. Looks like you're in charge now. Casemates and Valhalla are that way. We should get moving. What's the plan, Kingsley? Let's get a path cleared. You heard the Sarge. Clear that debris. Lights on the cliff. That's the coastal defense battery. The bridge is well guarded and the bank's too steep. We secure the bridge then. It's our only move. You're the boss.
Well, that was a fucking kerfuffle. <laughs> hey, Sarge got it done. We're still here, aren't we? I suppose. Eight men standing against the Nazi gun fort. Richard said I'd gone mad. Sometimes, a little madness is called for. I think deep down he understood that. And realized, we were cut from the same cloth. Bloody hell. They're waiting at the table up here. How's it looking, Sergeant? Best see for yourself. Let's get you the lay of the land. Our targets are the guns housed in those casemates. And we can only get there through a horde of Germans armed to the teeth. Think you can handle taking out the lower gun? I fancy my chances. That bunker's our way in, but it's packed with MGs. It'll be a hard push. First job's getting across that minefield. But that anti-tank ditch could be useful. I've got an idea. I'm all ears. We can punch a hole through the mines with those blitzers there. And the bunker will make mince meat out of us as soon as they hear the engines coming. We're going quiet then. No engines. Bail at the last second, let gravity do the work. That should get us to the ditch at least. Well? I love it. I think you should go first. <laughs> Alright then. As soon as you hit the ditch, get the men ready. Tommy, you with me? Oh, yeah. Drive through the minefield, take the bunker, strap some thermite to some highly explosive weapons. Piece of piss, Sarge. And you, get a second sun burning in the sky. If our ships don't see that flare, if they don't know we've won, they'll fire on the guns and risk taking us with them. Well, I don't know about you, but I think I'll take very little consolation in knowing that the fire that killed me was friendly. Don't worry, Gov. I won't forget to aim up. Truck's ready. We'll be right behind you. Godspeed, Kingsley.
Time to move. We're ready for all this gameplay. On my command, we charge! Charge! Go, go, go! Forward! Time to move! Case mates, I'll take the upper ones. Don't forget the flare. Let's move up. All right, Sarge. All the way, boys. This is it. You're on me. Hooray! Try and get back. We need to clear the door. All right, lads. Up of you. With me. Press it fire now.
over the top! Let's go! I'll cover ahead while you find a torch, Sarge. Bloody hell, it stinks in here. Sarge, torch over here. Best. <laughs> Bloody hell. Up ahead now. Look at that fucking monster. One down, one to go. That's the last of the thermite. Sarge, I could use your help here. What's up? 